Mr. Lamada. He will be starting soon. Oh, story time with Mr. Lamada. Where all your dreams come true. Oh, he brings to life. Your favorite stories with a great big smile. You won't leave lonely. Won't you start all the reading? I just can't wait to be hearing story time with Mr. Lamada. He will be starting soon. Oh, story time with Mr. Lamada. Where all your dreams come true. Oh, he brings to life your favorite stories with a great big smile. You won't leave lonely. Won't you start all the reading? I just can't wait to be here. joining me today happy happy what day are we on tuesday happy tuesday everybody welcome to story time <laughs> thank you so much for joining in <laughs> and it gets all the craziness all the fun from halloween spilling over into this tuesday morning i hope that you had fun i got to see on my street lots of fun um especially the street next ne ne one over was just amazing packed Everybody was out and about. Um, seems like a good time. And um, yeah, I'm glad that we're here together to enjoy another story. Thank you for being here with us. And um, it was good to see all those costumes on social media from all the different people. Thank you so much for sharing those. It was such um, um, to see such creativity and just fun. It was good to see that. Thank you so much for joining in. It was diving into a whole different world out there. Thank you so much for joining in. I hope that you had a lovely Monday, lovely Halloween. And of course, for those of you that were observing Dia de los Muertos, I hope that you um, also um, were able to do that peacefully and uh, indeed uh, uh, in honor of the loved ones. Thank you so much for joining in story time. I am glad that we are here together. You know, today we are talking about slowing down slowing down it always is always time is in a hurry one thing to the next and get this done and this and that but today tisha is reminding us say hey let's slow down a little bit this one is called tisha and the blossoms and this one is written by wendy medor and uh, illustrations by daniel Agnes. thank you so much for joining in story time today this one is coming to you from candlewick and it was released last year, 2021, but the first time that it is coming here to story time. Thank you so much for joining in. Tisha and the Blossoms. I hope you're ready for this one. Sounds like a music group, doesn't it? <laughs> Makes me want to burst into song right now. Thank you so much for joining in. I am glad that we're here together, ready to enjoy that wonderful story coming to us from Candlewick Press. But today, too, you know, talking about big milestones, learning something. And um, this time, our special mention is this one. It's called I Use the Party. This one is from Maria van Leishout. So if you get a chance, please find this one at your local library. It's a whole series. And um, yeah, great for little ones as they reach those big milestones. Thank you so much for joining in story time. I use the party. This one is called the Big Kid Power Series. Thank you so much for joining in story time today. Absolutely love it that we were here together. Yes, yes, yes. And coming up very shortly, Tisha and the Blossoms. Get ready to enjoy. Thank you so much for joining us. Let us see who is with us this morning, ready to enjoy that lovely story. Thank you for being here. Good morning to you, Sarah and Nathan out in cool Illinois. Thank you so much for joining in. And of course, Amanda West, good morning to you as well. Love the costumes. Thank you so much for joining in. <laughs> 
Thank you so much for joining in. And you say happy November. I'll tell you why I'm laughing in a little bit. Happy November. Yes, November is here. And oh, it is almost my birthday. Yes, indeed. Thank you so much for joining in. Story time. Absolutely love it. Thank you for joining us. Sarah and Nathan out in Cool, Illinois today and with uh, Amanda West. And we know that out there today, it is cool, cool, cool. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you for being here. Out here in Oakland today, rain, rain, rain. It was raining through the night. It'll be raining throughout the day. So yeah, a wonderful day. Perfect weather for stories. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining in. And I see you, Blessed, trying to throw me off. It is Tuesday today. Thank you so much for joining us on Storytime. Good morning to you. <laughs> Thank you for being here. Unless you're visiting somewhere far out, far east, maybe Japan or something. Thank you so much for joining us from out in Vermont. Thank you for being here. Absolutely appreciate you being here with us. Blessed Ngoma out in um, Vermont. And of course, we hope that Willow is okay too. Thank you so much for joining us on Storytime. Absolutely appreciate you. Good morning to you. Pamela Courtney, how are you doing today? Braylon, Chad, and Tian, good morning to you and welcome to Storytime. Sleepy, hello it is. <laughs> Still stuck from last night's weenie roast and s'mores. Oh, my goodness. Oh, the party was definitely happening out there in Nakitosh, Louisiana. Hopefully join you next time. Thank you so much for joining in. Glad you're here. You know what? This is the perfect place to be sleepy. We have a wonderful story to enjoy together. And today we're talking about slowing down. Slow down. Let's slow it down a little bit. And I wish that everybody indeed gets that time today to just slow it down and... um enjoy a little bit more of what's around you enjoy a little bit more conversation enjoy a little bit more listening enjoy a little bit more of the company around you thank you so much i know pamela courtney you've mentioned just laying in bed and reading a book that does sound amazing i hope that you get to do more of that today thank you so much for joining us on story time absolutely appreciate you good morning from erin and clara it's a wet and mild day out in massachusetts thank you for joining us hope you had a good Good Halloween. It was good. Got lots of bells ringing out here. It was a wonderful evening indeed. Thank you so much for joining in here on Storytime. And it was especially good to see the people outside. It was packed. The one street over was closed off and it was just kids everywhere just running around with their baskets of goodies. So yeah, a wonderful evening. Good sights to see. Thank you so much for sharing and thank you for joining in Storytime today from out in Massachusetts where it is mild today. I'm pretty sure for me that would be freezing. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining in. Good morning to you. Sharon Longo, one more time. Good morning to you. And of course, Soraya, thank you for joining us on Storytime. Please do not go away. We have a story coming up. This one is called Tisha and the Blossoms. And this one is coming from uh, Candlewick Press. And of course, Wendy Medor and Daniel Igneus. Thank you so much for joining us on Storytime. And I'm pretty sure I am butchering those names, but if you know better, please send me the pronunciations. <laughs> Good morning to you, Sheva Chanda, out in Lusaka, Zambia. Thank you so much for joining us. Yes, indeed. I hope that you are having a wonderful time. I hope that you had a lovely day today. And I hope indeed that you do have a wonderful evening up ahead. Thank you so much for joining in Storytime today. Absolutely love it. Here we go. Getting ready for this one. Tisha and the Blossoms. Join me on the other side of this very short break that we have today. Thank you indeed for being here with us on Storytime. I hope that you enjoy this wonderful book that we have here together. <laughs> I'll be right back. Hola. My name is Shamile Sayed Mendez, and I am the author of Where Are You From, Foodia, and many other books for young readers. You're watching Storytime with Mr. Limara. Hi, my name is Chad, and, and I'm homeschooled in Natchitoches, Louisiana. And today you're tuning in with Mr. Limara. Storytime with Mr. Limara. Ha, 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 ha. 
Love it. Straight from my heart every time, every single time. I absolutely appreciate you. Thank you, Braylon. And um, yeah, thank you indeed. And of course, Shamila Sayed Mendes has brought us many books, including this lovely, lovely book here that we have, Where Are You From? So please be sure to find it at your local library. Here we go with today's story. This one is called Tisha and the blossoms. Yes, this one coming to you from Wendy Medar and illustrations by Daniel Igneus. And we're reading this one with permission of the publishers, Candlewick Press, a 2021 release, first time on Storytime. Here we go. Enjoy. <laughs> Lots of um, books that remind me of... Uh, um, Four that we'll, we'll be reading these next few weeks. Tisha, Tisha and the Blossoms. Ah, oh, are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready for the Blossoms? <laughs> this one is written by Wendy Medor, illustrations by Daniel Ignace, and we're reading this one with permission of Candlewick Press. Love those purples in here. All the different hues of purple. Love it. Tisha was create was catching a blossom in her backyard. Hurry up, cried mommy. You will be late for school. Mm. We have mornings like that at times. Yeah. Tisha was catching a blossom in her backyard. Hurry up, cried mommy. You will be late for school. <laughs> Harry, Harry. On the way, Tisha stopped to listen to the sounds. Hurry up, shouted the bus driver. I'm running late. Oh my goodness, can the harrying stop already? <laughs> On the way, Tisha stopped to listen to the sounds. Hurry up, shouted the bus driver. I'm running late. <laughs> Have you had to run for the bus today? Oh. In the classroom, Tisha found a book about space. Oh, ready to enjoy. Hurry up, said the teacher. We'll be late for the assembly. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh. Hurry up. We'll be late for the assembly, said the teacher. Oh my goodness. <laughs> At recess, Tisha found a ladybug. She began to count the spots. One, two, three. Hurry up, called her friend, or you will miss lunch. <laughs> oh my goodness, having to hurry even at recess. Imagine that. Oh my goodness. Hurry up, called her friend. Oh, you will miss lunch. Don't want to do that, do we? <laughs> oh, poor Tisha. After lunch, Tisha drew a space shuttle. It had three windows, two wheels, and one bright red, one bright red wood. Hurry up, said the teacher. It's time to put the crayons away. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, it is time to put the crayons away. Hurry up. <laughs> well, maybe she'll get to finish that drawing later. After school was over, Mani kissed Tisha and took her and took her backpack. Let's hurry so we don't miss the bus. No, thank you, sniffed Tisha. No. <laughs> What's the matter? asked Mommy. Oh. Yeah. Let's hurry so we don't miss the bus. No, thank you, said Tisha, sniffing. What's the matter? asked Mommy. <laughs> I have done too much hurrying up today, Tisha said. 
Can we please have a little slowdown? Mommy smiled. If your legs aren't too tired, would you like to walk home? It's only a few blocks away. Yes, please, said Tisha. Aww. <laughs> yes, can we please have a little slowdown? <laughs> when I was a little girl, said Mommy, I used to love playing. I used to love playing how many? Like, how many yellow cars can you see? There is one over there, Tisha pointed. Oh. <laughs> can you see the yellow car too? Yeah, where is it? Right here? Ah, oh, it's right there. I see it too. <laughs> On the walk home, they saw five seagulls, four children, three blue umbrellas, two sausage dogs, and one enormous hat. <laughs> Can you see the enormous hat? Yeah. How about the five seagulls? Can you see them? The four children? <laughs> How about the blue umbrellas? Three of them. Oh, I see them too. <laughs> oh. Then they sat on the beach in the sunshine and gave names to all the pigeons in the park. Oh. <laughs> it is nice to relax, isn't it? Slow it down just a little bit. Then they sat down on the beach, on the bench, on, on the beach, on the bench. <laughs> they sat down on the bench in the sunshine and gave names to all the pigeons in the park. <laughs> I think I'm going to do that today. I'm going to find a park and sit. Well, it will be raining. Maybe when the rain breaks, we'll see. You two must be hungry, Daddy said. I'd better hurry up and get dinner. Why don't we have a picnic instead, said Mommy. Oh, yes, I love picnics, Tisha clapped. Aww. <laughs> we can crunch the cucumbers, chew the cheese, and feel the pickles tingle our tongues, said Mommy. Aww. <laughs> I definitely love to crunch cucumbers too. Oh. <laughs> Daddy could crunch the loudest. Mommy could chew for the longest. And Tisha's tongue was the one that could tingle the most. Oh, look at those colors on these pages. Love it. Then a soft wind blew and the blossoms began to fall. Let's catch one, Tisha said. Oh. <laughs> catch as many as you want. Oh my goodness. Yes, then a soft wind blew and the blossoms began to fall. Let's catch one, Tisha said. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Look at that. Definitely lost in paradise. <laughs> I love it. I think my favorite days, sighed Tisha, are full of blossoms and a bit of, I'm gonna guess what, a bit of what? <laughs> I think my favorite days, sighed Tisha, Ah, are full of blossoms and a bit of, what do you think? A bit of what? <laughs> and a bit of slowing down. Ah. And that is the end of our story for today. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining in, friends. Catch me on the other side of this short break when we're back for more story time. <laughs>
Hi, I'm Auntie Pam of the Homeschooling Ken Folks down here in Natchitoches, Louisiana, and you're tuned in to Storytime with Mr. LaMotta. Hello, hello, and welcome back. Thank you so much. Thank you, Auntie Pam, and of course, Chad in the mix. Thank you so much for joining us on Storytime. Absolutely appreciate you. And today we're reading Tisha and the Blossoms. It's not a singing group. No, it's just Tisha enjoying the blossoms, enjoying the slowing down. I hope that indeed today all of you have an opportunity to slow down, an opportunity to Take in a little more of what's around you. Take in a little more of the conversations and the people around you and just get to enjoy yourself. Thank you so much for joining in Story Time. Absolutely appreciate you. And it's a good reminder for me too. I think I will try and do that today as well. Slow down just a little bit. Thank you so much for being here. And um, self-care, mental health are very important. And uh, please, 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 if you can, and I hope that you can, Find those spaces in which you can relax. Maybe even take a nap if you're a napper like me. Thank you so much for joining in Storytime today. Absolutely appreciate you. Let us see one more time who is with us here on Storytime enjoying that lovely story. Thank you, Sheba Chanda, for joining us on Storytime today. Absolutely love it. I hope that you have a wonderful evening, wonderful rest of the day out there in Lusaka, Zambia. Thank you so much for joining us. Good morning to you one more time, Soraya. Thank you for being here with us. And um, yes, love the costume, <laughs> the impatient caterpillar. Love it, love it, love it. But you know what? The sticky spider still remains too. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining in Storytime. And of course, Sharon Lungo hugs to you. Thank you for being here with us on Storytime. Erin and Clara, thank you for joining us. Lovely costumes as well. It's a wet and mild day out there in Massachusetts. Please do stay dry and I hope that you read many stories today. Thank you so much for joining in Storytime. Hope you had a good Halloween too. Thank you so much for joining in Storytime today. Absolutely appreciate you. Braylon, Chad, Good morning to you. I hope that that left you a little bit awake, a little bit more awake. But indeed, we encourage you, slow it down some more if you want to. Thank you so much for joining in Story Time. Yes, full bellies, full hearts, I hope, too. Thank you so much for joining us on Story Time. Brennan, Chad, Auntie Anne, and of course, Auntie Pam. Oh, hugs to you. Thank you for being here with us on Story Time. Blessed Ngoma. Wednesday for you, Tuesday here on Storytime. Thank you so much for joining in. Absolutely appreciate you. I hope that you have a wonderful rest of the day. Thank you for being here with us on Storytime. Thank you, thank you indeed for joining us. Absolutely appreciate you. And of course, Sarah and Nathan, thank you so much for joining in Storytime today. Happy November to you too. Yes, the birthday month is here. Thank you for being here with us on Storytime. Um, just today, here is one beautiful one to slowing down. I hope that you find that time to slow down. Thank you for joining us. Amanda West, thank you for being here. And remember to our special mention for today is this one. I use the party. Yes, big kid power. I use the party. This one from Maria van Lysout. So if you can find it, find it at your local library and indeed celebrate those big milestones. Thank you so much for joining in story time today. Absolutely appreciate appreciate each and every one of you. And of course, story time is back tomorrow with another exciting story and one of my favorite authors for sure, Fran Preston Gannon is back on story time. And this time we'll be reading The Bad Day. Oh, find out what this one is all about. Join in and enjoy the fun. Thank you so much for being here with us on story time. Absolutely appreciate you. Have a wonderful day wherever you are today. Hugs, hugs, hugs. Biggest hugs to you and your loved ones. And I hope indeed uh, um, that you find space to relax today. Space to slow down. Thank you for being here on Storytime. See you again tomorrow for more Storytime. There's no slowing down on bringing the books here to Storytime. <laughs> But I think we might be due a break pretty soon, one of these weeks coming up. But, oh, I love it being here so much with all of you. And um, I hope that you do have a wonderful day. See you tomorrow for more story time. Much love from me. Bye-bye. <laughs> Brings to life your favorite 
stories with a great big smile. You won't leave lonely, won't you start all the reading? I just can't wait to be reading. Away, others right here in my neighborhood. Story time. Story time. Story time with Mr. Lamada. He will be starting soon. Thank you. 